Hello, this is Seth with a real rapid review of two of the new accessories that have come out for the Speedians. Um, no, I'm not happy to see you. This is what they call the Bluetooth ring in my pocket. It is really cool. Really cool. One negative, a lot of positives. You can see there's a little thing you can spin on it to put the weight up and down, and you just push it to turn it on or off. It's worked every time, but once I had to push it twice because it didn't recognize it. Other than that, it worked great. A little hard to hook up at first. The directions that come with it don't tell you anything, but I reached out to Speedy and they sent me a thing on how to how to do it. So if you have any troubles connecting it initially to your Speedy, let me know and I'll tell you how to do it. But this thing's really nice. One negative. This is all you can use. Once you connect this to the Bluetooth, everything else is gone. The two handles and the, the smart part of the bar don't work. Now, I'm no math major, but one, two, three, I used to have three things connected to Bluetooth, and now I can only have one. Um, I did mention this is Speedians. They said they're working on a software update so you can connect all of them. I don't think that should be an issue. It should be pretty easy to do. This is the best one by far, but I'd love to be able to use this and the smart handles. But this thing's really cool. You can put it on any finger, works great. Uh, the next thing. This, the smart, no, not smart bar, adjustable bar. So you can see here, it adjusts very easily and very quick. Now, that worried me a little bit because that doesn't seem very sturdy. It really is. I can't pull that off and when you start lifting, it is solid. It is solid. And I have them mixed up. I change this back. It takes me no time at all. And once you do it, let me get it undone. Once you do it, you'll hear a little click and then it's locked in. Really good for bench. Uh, with the last bar, the bench would shut off around 180 for me, for whatever reason. Maybe I'm doing something wrong, I don't know. With this one, I've gone, I think, to 210 or 216, but then it still shuts off. The other day, I tried it like 30 times, and it kept saying I'm going too fast. I would go as slow as I could, and it would still say I'm going too fast. So, like I said, maybe I'm doing something. Maybe I need to try to go faster. I've, I've tried everything, and I can't get it to do it. Not a big deal, because it gets heavy enough. I wish I could go a little bit heavier, but it's not a big deal. This is better than the other bar, much better. Even has some things in here I haven't used yet, some attachments, but real easy to use, really nice bar. Um, the handles have worked heavier, so I, like I said, I don't know if it's just something that's not that it doesn't like, but this is very nice. Uh, one last thing I did hear from two people that had their cables break. I'm like, oh man, that's a nightmare, it wor worries me. They were, they're happy. They said they got new cables and they could not believe how easy it is to fix. Once you open up the machine, apparently it's super easy to fix. I haven't had to do that, fortunately, but it puts my mind at ease knowing that, hey, if something happens to the cables, they're easily replaced, they're not expensive, and, and that's a good thing. So all in all, still real happy. Everything's working great. The new little um, speed inch ring here, really cool. Pick this up, it's really, really nice, and hopefully they'll have an update where you can use all the Bluetooth. So everything's good with the Speedians. Hope it's going well with you. If you haven't purchased it, go ahead and do it. ABC ya.